Dear Activision, your game is busted, and it needs to be fixed. You bilk your customers for millions. You sell reskins of the same crap, re-release and remake the same game, then sell for full price. Like, what the fuck is that? I'm not asking for a lot. Just a game that doesn't break mid-match damn near every game. Let's just review a few of these real quick. The rubber banding, the lag, getting random kick from match. Oh, and falling through the map. Yeah, that happens. Good dedicated servers, is that a thing? Random revive bug that makes you slide around the map like an homage to the fucking exorcist? Or... Evil Dead? Yeah, that would be more accurate. It took almost 10 minutes to find a workaround. We had to push them in the fucking water and drown them, then revive a second time to fix the bug. Kindly go fuck yourself for leaving this in the game. DMZ is my favorite mode. I play Warzone 2.0, no, and multiplayer on Modern Warfare 2020, ew, and enjoy both, but DMZ is the most fun to me. Squatting up with a couple buddies and running missions. Maybe adding some randoms along the way. The buff nerf cycle with DAI is aggravating, yes. The griefing of opposition, who is just bored, bro, is annoying as well, but that's COD. On COD, bro. <laughs> as long as I'm complaining about stuff with Activision, can we just real quick talk about Warzone 1 and all the crap that we bought for that game and how none of it came over to Warzone 2.0? Like, what the fuck was that? You're telling me that you can't even bring the skins for the operators? Change it a little bit? I don't know. But seriously, what the fuck, Activision? Do you just want to steal all of our money? I mean, yeah, you're a multi-million dollar conglomerate corporation bullshit ass fucking Dark Shadow group Illuminati. But... It's a little much, and we keep taking it. If you're gonna fuck my ass, at least lube it up, come on. Bruh, it's still in beta. Oh, thanks. Had no idea, appreciate the info. Maybe fix it, take it out of beta? Crazy idea, I know. Regardless of my thoughts on any of this, it won't change. Us, the chumps, will continue to play and purchase the garbage. Definition of insanity? Doing the same thing and expecting a different outcome. Boss, 2012. <laughs> That's from Far Cry 3 for all you kiddos out there. Honestly, we probably are crazy. We continue to play the same broke game with the same stupid mechanics that let people jump up and down and avoid getting hit by shots that shockingly are traveling at the speed of a bullet. You know what else travels at the speed of a bullet? Superman. I guess that's why we can't hit him. We can only blame ourselves if we keep repeating the cycle. Battlefield 2042 was as much if not more of a mess and millions left that game. The devs at DICE, EA, Bioware, Illuminati Inc, whatever, figured out they fucked up. Way too late. They say, it's a good game now doesn't matter. No one is there and no one wants to play it anymore. Learn from the mistakes of others, Activision. Don't be the corporate jackasses too busy doing blow to keep their company safe. I'm sure a lot of people will just ignore this, but it needed to be said. Overall, Modern Warfare 2 2022, whatever you want to call it, and its side modes, Warzone and DMZ, are fun when they work. So keep them working! Sincerely, Ya yeah boy, the sauce. Sauce. Activision needs to hire a koala bear for some quality assurance. 